You are now listening to 5 Minutes with KCM, the segment that takes an inside look into the operations of Konkola Copper Mines, KCM, Zambia's largest integrated copper producer. KCM is a subsidiary of the Danta Resources PLC. Friday the 25th of September 2015. Good morning to you and thank you once again for joining us on this show 5 Minutes with KCM. Sponsored by Konkola Copper Mines. Now hosting the show this morning, my name is Hope Chishala. Now last week we had a chat around the impact of KCM's education programs. And this morning we are looking at one of the key components of the business at KCM and this is environmental management which is very very important. Now to help me discuss this very important subject is the Vice President's Technical Mr. David Ingandu and he begins by describing KCM's operations in Zambia and the company's environmental management program. KCM is an integrated copper producer which means that we mine copper from the ground and then refine it to the point where it is regarded as pure. In fact, the end product is 99.999% pure copper. We have two major mining operations, the Nchanga operations, where we operate both uh, an open pit uh, uh, and underground mine. We also operate we also operate the Konkola underground mine. Both of these are world-scale mining operations. At Nchanga, We've been mining since 1935 and have produced more, than, more copper there than in any other mine in Africa. At Konkola, we have a massive ore body that will be operating for decades to come. We also have two concentrators which convert ore into concentrate. We have a world-class motor that converts the concentrate to metal. And then um, we have a refiner which purifies the metal into a form which we can, which can be traded on the London Metals uh, Exchange. Managing the, envir- the environmental impact of our operations is very important for a few reasons. Firstly, it is important because of the communities that live around our operations. We need to ensure that we are not impacting on the quality of life of creating uh, a modern mining uh, company. Environmental management is really all about reducing waste. Uh, and when we reduce waste, we are more cost effective business. We do many things actually. But they have to talk about two major areas, the construction of our smelter. The things we do to protect water. Over the last 10 years, Concola Mines has spent over $760 million on environmental management projects at its mine. The project, in terms of costs, was the construction of a new smelter in Chingola. Up until 2009, KCM operated the smelter in Kita that had been in use since the 1960s. However, it was a product of an earlier period in the mining industry and it was both inefficient and caused a lot of pollution. Listeners from Quito may well recall the smell of sulfur in the air around that smelter. In 2010, more than $500 million to build. It was a world class technology and something that we should be very proud of in Zambia. In fact, it is one of the best smelters of its type in the world. There's only one other smelter in the world that is cleaner and it is in Japan. It had two major advantages. It ensured that the air around the smelter is much cleaner, but it is also much more efficient and produces copper at lower cost. That is something we often find that good environmental performance makes good business sense. We've done quite a lot uh, to reduce the water we use and uh, protect the water around our operations. We've uh, built two new concentrators that use a lot less water. This also makes them more cost effective, and at the same time, it reduces the amount of water we need to treat and uh, dispose of. We've also done a lot of work to replace old pipes and pumps discharge, which is a great achievement. It reduces the amount of water we use and reduces our environmental impact. KSM has also invested in new, invested in uh, new Muntimpa tailings pipelines to avoid leakages to the environment. We conduct annual fish restocking and tree planting programs as part of improvements to the environment and agriculture. We've undertaken uh, underground rehabilitation of water handling and pumping, decreasing total suspended solids in the water discharged from the Concola mine. Mm-hmm. The, the, we pump out at least 350,000 cubic meters of water from Concola mine every day. This treated water is clean and safe to drink and is thus distributed to Mulonga and storage company for free and the rest is discharged into the Kafue River. You know, $5 million has been invested in the 
set of the set of the art and machinery to ensure the water being pumped up. Well, great information there from KCM's uh, Vice President uh, Technical, Mr. David Ingando. And well, this is all we had for you on the show this morning. So you can join us next week at the same time as we take a look at another interesting discussion about Africa's target integrated copper mine. So until next week at the same time, thank you so much for joining us. This has been 5 Minutes with KCM. That was 5 Minutes with KCM. Join us again next week at the same time for a chance to know more about Konkola Copper Mines, Zambia's largest integrated copper producer. KCM is... Paint your house. Well, I know a couple of people that want to do that.